Okay. Uh, this is going to be a recap of the 6x6 mini album I've just finished for Pratt for Christmas 2015. It is a paper pack uh, called Engraver from Prima and beautiful papers and I thought of Pratt when I saw them. I was looking for something that kind of um, represented some of his interests and in this case it's got words like in this particular sheet that I've used for both the front and back covers uh, culture, I know he's on a board uh, that's a cultural organization uh, journey, respect, original, lots of things that I think are reflective of uh, his work with uh, cultural organizations it has a three inch spine that I have covered on the outside with some vinyl for some security and stability and as I said, it is a handmade uh, chipboard cover, uh, six by six, with it has six interactive pages inside. So let's take a look at those. So on the inside front cover, we have a hinged pocket. I love all of the papers from this collection. This one is like a globe and uh, a map papers with some script on it, and it's uh, just really cool. And I've made a hinged pocket there, which means that it's going to have the ability to hold quite a lot of items. And then moving over to the first uh, page, the interactive page, it has a flap, and I've used a Martha Stewart punch, just a half inch edge punch in various places throughout the album. And uh, this just opens, and here I have put a little bit of a reinforced um, tab, if you will, that will hold a number of items behind it. In this case, I've just put a little um, little tab that I've made or sticker that I've made that sits behind there. And then we have a, a horizontal belly band, again with some of that great paper, and I just created a little bit of a photo book. And uh, you can put photos inside this, or you could write in a, with a gel pen in white or any other color uh, other than black that uh, you could make notes uh, and so on. So perhaps you could um, save pictures from some of his meetings or some of the groups that he works with and, that, and so on. And as I said, each of these is a pocket page and so it has a good sized photo mat in it and uh, five of the six pages have those. Then moving along, this next page, again beautiful paper and it has a bit of script on this piece that I've used and uh, reinforced to set up a bit of a flap there or a tab to hold something tucked in and I just made a little bit of a, a smaller little photo book that for the moment is just sitting underneath this little tab right there. And on this side it's a divided pocket and in this case I've got a couple of um, pieces put in there that uh, have the design paper on them and then this opens as well and you can put an item here and uh, you could record, you could journal on this side and this also has a side pocket that uh, is hinged and will hold quite a lot there. Oh, and this also has the photo mat in it that I mentioned uh, before, so that's the one for this particular page. Then on this side there's a horizontal belly band uh, that you could put something underneath, a photo or whatever the case is. And I also popped up on the bottom here on some cardstock a clock image and uh, that's just attached at the bottom, open at the top. So whatever you slid underneath the belly band could also just go uh, under that little tab to keep it in place. And on this side we have a pocket. And there's the photo mat page that goes with this one. And then we've got a double page uh, that coordinate and on this side uh, a little flap that is created there to hold. I've just made a little tag in this case with some of the clock images. I really like those papers. Um, that is representative of what you can put inside there. The these flaps are just attached at the bottom so you'll be able to put quite a bit inside there. Then this page has another one of the reinforced uh, tabs with a clock image and on this side I've got a vertical belly band that you can tuck something in underneath and hold it in place and again on this side another one of the pockets that's just attached at the bottom with a little tag with the clock image on it and then this side is left open 
the two outside uh, flaps are left open. You could attach pictures or leave it just decorative. It's, uh, I think it looks nice just the way it is. And then this is the photo mat that goes with this particular page. Then on this side we've got some great um, map paper and I just made a, a nice tag that uh, again just tucks in there for the time being and it has another one of the reinforced tabs here to put something underneath with one of the clock in images on it. And this page is in fact a split page so um, they work independent from one another and each one of them has a tag inside and has uh, some design paper on both sides. And again, you can attach a photo, you could write on it, you could put almost anything you wanted on those, and those two are the same. And then this flips over, and again, some of that great paper with compass imagery, as, along with maps and some script. And uh, those two pages I just left open for attaching whatever uh, Pratt might like. And this one has a vertical belly band, and just a little photo book has been tucked inside. Uh, that particular band. Oh, and this one is a pocket page. And that's the photo mat. And then over to the last of the pages, uh, this one opens up with two flaps and that's a magnetized piece of chipboard with a brad that attaches it to uh, the one side and then it opens up and you have space here for a photo or some other type of memorabilia that you might like to put inside. And then that just closes like that and it, the magnet holds it closed. And the inside back cover is again one of the hinged pockets so that it holds quite a lot. And, uh, and that's the photo book for Pratt.